What is up, everybody? This is Majin Grimlock, and we are back with ReZero, which is Resurrection. We also have a new summon out. I probably could have done a video on that. If you want to see me do a summon video on this game, again, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see whatever the next summon is next week. I'll think about it. But this week, we have a new Regulus card. This little hammer right here means that it is a strike attack. So, and if you, I'm playing Garfield now. As you can see, he needs strike attack abilities, as well as defending and healing. So, all of those have an extra effect on Garfield. And I don't have very many good strike abilities, so that's why I needed the regulars. And I actually pulled two. If you pull a copy of any card, any ability, it's used to raise up your luck. So. Whenever you go into an event that gives items when you when you beat the enemy, you get an extra chance of getting good items, getting more items if you have a copy of your abilities. So, whether it's worth getting copies or not, that's up to you. I just wasn't expecting it. I'm glad I got one. So, let's try it. Yeah, those gold butterflies or whatever kind of flies those are. They don't really mean anything. They just show up. And Garfield always do this first to raise up his attack. Now let's test out this regular ability. See how much damage. Keep in mind it also depends on the max damage your character can do. You can also upgrade that. So always keep that in mind. Yeah, they did a lot of damage. So I have to I need to look at his stats again. I don't remember how where his max is for me. Oh that that's not going too bad. Again, my Garfield is like level 37. And remember what I said about every hit counting is energy points. So that Garfield ability as well as this Halloween ROM. This is also a strike ability for some reason. Now let me just go ahead and heal. And that poison lasts for four turns. Oh well. And I realized that... Okay, it froze for a minute. I realized that Regulus has some kind of ability when you're fighting him where he can basically reduce all damage to one. I learned that the hard way. Let me go ahead and raise up my attack again, just in case. Oh, that poison hurry from where I got one more turn after this. Heal again. Gotta wait for my moves to come back anyway. I don't remember how this feel this card works. Oh, okay, just heal me off rip. I know there's one Felix ability. It raises your health gradually. I just forgot which one I had. Ooh, I love this one. I love this card. Yeah, Garfield is my second strongest character next to Rom. But the thing that I've learned about Rom, I didn't realize this until I started working on other characters. She has the least amount of health. And Garfield, he might have the most health. I'm not really sure. But by the time he was half of Rom's level, he had twice as much health as her. So... Yeah, take that into consideration when you're building your characters. Their stats. I I haven't had time to work on everybody yet. I know easier than I thought. But it's the solo battle, so they didn't want they didn't want you to struggle too hard playing solo. Thankfully. Most of these events are meant for you to work with a team. So don't be discouraged if you go into an event and it's hard for you to beat it yourself. 
Only problem comes in and trying to find teammates sometimes. You know, you're playing at the wrong time of day. You might not find too much help. Oh, I, I think this one where I can just do it infinitely so it doesn't kick me out the stage. Because when, it when it's guaranteed to give you a reward, once you beat it one time, once you beat the requirements once, it just kicks you out the map. I prefer not to be kicked out. I want to just stay around for a minute. So, let's go here. Wait, no. I bet. I forgot I'm supposed to switch. Anyway. So we're gonna try this one. Still gonna keep regulars. This Garfield and Mimi ability I have in the middle raises, I believe it's attack and crit rate for 15 turns. I think I got that right. I did not. That is max physical damage and earth element damage, not crit rate. And I have this Ram healing ability instead of Felix. My beef is with these two Ram cards. This is the two star version of the Demon Ram ability, but I keep I like to keep this one because it can stun. And this one, it costs zero energy, but the hit rate is abysmal. I've missed this a lot and it has cost me many games. But, still gonna try it. At least until I get something else. might be my new favorite duo from this season. Going to do the regular, the one shot. Oh! No, no, no. There we go. Save him for last. So they did 424. I believe this car, regular this car, actually, it also raises up, raises up your um, max damage. Oh no, this is the Garfield and Mimi car that does this. I'm tripping. Alright, this please don't miss. And I'm poisoned again, of course. Yeah. Yeah, the Garfield and Mimi does raise up your max damage. That was something I just, for some reason, neglected at first. So, I just want to let you guys know that is important. Now, let's see how much this rim heals me for. And Felix did more. Uh, yeah, I think I found one day I need to do a tier list. Let me know if you guys would be interested in that one day. It's a tier list of all the abilities, specifically, specifically the three stars. It might be fun to try one day. And now, Rim. Let's see if I can stun. This car can also miss too, so I hope it doesn't. Well, it hit, but she didn't stun. Oh, the Eulet can stun for two turns. And this poison is annoying. Okay, I missed. Yeah, that's what happens when you miss. Regulus, go ahead and finish yourself. Oh no, he got the he has that ability. I just realized it. No. That that little sun right there, I think that's it. Where he reduces any damage taken to freaking one. I immediately forgot about that. Hmm. 
Okay. Ah, shut up. Okay, we hit this time. Whew. When I started using healing, I for some reason avoided using healing abilities too. I don't know why I did. Yeah, that worked out, but as you saw, as you saw, it's a lot rougher that time around than the first time. Because these moves that can miss can easily cost you. But these are guaranteed to hit. So let me know what you guys think. I think I'm still gonna play around with Garfield some more. I need to get Ron to 50. But I do need to get Garfield to at least 40 as well. So let me know what you guys think. And comment down below if you want to see me play another character, maybe Rim, Subaru, or whoever. But make sure you like and subscribe, and see you guys next time.